Hello! Hey friends! Today we are going to be wire wrapping crystals. <laughs> so a few weeks ago I went to Great Salt Plains State Park in Jet, Oklahoma and dug for crystals. We spent two and a half hours. We got a huge tub of them. <laughs> got about six pounds of crystals. Now we have all these crystals. What are we going to do with them? You can't sell them. You can make things. So we are going to be making some wire wrapped crystal jewelry. I'm a beginner. I've never done this before. I looked at some YouTube videos. I thought that looks fun. Let's try it. Surprisingly, I thought that this was actually really simple and really easy to do. I actually have one that I'm wearing right now that I made. And this took me less than five minutes to make. So we're going to do that today. I've got all my supplies here um, and then we will try a few and we'll go from there. First off, I've got two different sizes of wire. I have a 24 gauge and then I have an 18 gauge and I've got three different kinds. This one is a 24 gauge brass copper wire. And then I've got an 18 gauge copper wire. It's a little bit thicker. And then I've got the 24 gauge in the same color of the, the copper wire. I've got two different kinds of pliers. I have some needle nose pliers with wire cutters, and then I have a pair of round wires so that we can make some fancy rings on our crystals. I've got a pen and I will show you what I'm going to do with that. Um, and then I've got some chains. All of this I got at Hobby Lobby for around $20 total. So really reasonable. Um, I got all these chains 50% off bonus. Uh, all of this jewelry supplies, these were 50%. The wires were not. And then last but not least, we have our crystals. <laughs> so we are going to be wire wrapping a few of these. Like I said, I'm a beginner. I've never done this. I don't make jewelry. I've never tried wire wrapping before. I literally just went into Hobby Lobby, looked around, went to the jewelry section, found this wire, and I thought, let's give it a shot. I looked up some YouTube videos. I thought I can do that. So let's go. All right, we've got all our supplies here. We have our three kinds of different wire. We have our two uh, sets of pliers, our chains, and our crystals. do this one first. I don't know. It's kind of long and narrow. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to do the, um, let's do this brass 24 gauge wire. And you want to cut about three feet of wire. So let's see. Let's see. One, Two, three. Then you're going to basically fold it in half. Get a loop at the end. And here's where the pen comes in. I didn't learn this on the first couple that I made. I just like tried to make a loop and it's like really janky looking as you can see. And then I realized, cause I didn't have round wires, um, but you can use a pen. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna wrap it around once this way. And then I'm gonna wrap it around the other way once, like three loops there. And then just twist it like, two or three times. Okay. There we go. Not bad, right? Nice, pretty loop there. Cool. All right. So you can either do like single wire um, wrapping around your crystal or you can double it up. 
let's double it up and let's see I'm trying to think of what I want on top I think I like this side being up okay I'm gonna leave a little bit of room so I'm gonna pull set this on the back right up against it and then leave this the wrapping here or the little twisty part I'm gonna leave that up so then when we bring the wrap the wire back around we'll make a bail to reinforce it so I literally just have this on the back like so bend it You want to wrap the wire as tight as possible so that it doesn't like come off the crystal. Okay. We've wrapped it. It's wrapped on the back. And then now, this extra bit of wire, I'm going to just wrap around um, this here to create just a nice reinforced bail. Something to keep in mind about selenite is that it's actually like very soft and can break pretty easily. Um, it's not like quartz. Like I have a hard like quartz here and this is like really strong. Like you can't, it doesn't scratch easily. Selenite scratches very easily. Um, and so you can kind of see right here, there's a little bit of a, like scratch. So when you're wrapping the wire, you just want to be careful that you're not like scratching the selenite. You want it to be tight enough to where the wire is not going to, crystal is not going to come out, but not too tight to where you break the crystal. Okay, let's try another one. All right, I think this time I'm going to do the 18 gauge wire. Um, hmm. Ooh, I like this one. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to do, I don't think I need as long because I'm going to single wrap this one because it's such, it's quite a bit thicker. Yeah, that'll look really pretty. So I honestly think I only need like two feet see one is so much thicker nice crystal.
Okay, I'm not sure how I feel about this one. So I think I need to tighten it here. So if you need to tighten the wire anywhere, you can just do a, you can just crimp it. Don't go yet. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.